Hey guys, what's up? Musical Eagle here. Um, I thought this would be a pretty cool review. Um, since this wasn't really released as a uh, normal pack, um, I thought it'd be cool to uh, do a little review on the old school Pokemon cards that I just received, which were the um, the blah, 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 Southern Island set. Um, now, if I'm not mistaken, I I think I looked this up on the Psypoke site. Um, so, yeah. Uh, this set was uh, made after, I believe, Neo Genesis. As you can see, it does have the uh, Neo type of uh, display format on the um, card itself. Um, like uh, the Entei that was given uh, as a promo card for the Pokemon third movie, um, some of these cards were reversed hollows, uh, I guess you can call them that, reverse hollow cards with the background as being hollow rather than the image itself being hollow with the Pokemon inside. Um, first off, I would like to say that uh, check out these two channels, WXYZ Boy, for hooking me up with these cards, and um, I believe his name is Slithercoon on YouTube. He's hooking me up with uh, three free cards, but he's not gonna give them away for just for like free for you guys but not to be cocky but um do subscribe to him I, I have to do him a huge favor i i can't thank him enough for um giving me those three cards so i'll be expecting those in the mail and expect those to be a tcbm or mail time video all right getting on to the review i am missing one card and that's the southern islands mew and i am looking for that but um there a kid kid posted one on YouTube um, that he was trading trading but it was not in the greatest condition it was only worth a dollar uh, another thing is don't send me eBay links to see oh here is this card or here's that card uh, I can't really use eBay right now uh, don't really have funds in that so yeah alright so we're gonna start with the second card since the first card was Mew uh, this would be the uh, Pidgeot. Let's see if I can move this first out of the way. It's just easier. Okay, Pidgeot. Uh, so yeah. It's Pidgeot right there. Non reverse hollow card regular. Um, it's 2 out of 18. You can see the, the circular um, stage, uh, evolution stages. Uh, whereas the, let me pull one up for you guys, this muck here, you can see that, I don't know if you can tell well you guys can see that, but it's kind of like a diamond shaped and this one's like a circle shaped uh, staged evolution. So yeah, another thing you can see is on the bottom how it has the crescents, um, I believe that base one, two, one, base one and two, uh, fossil and jungle did not have this. Uh, so that was, again, that's a, a lot different from the normal Pokemon cards that came out. Um, so yeah, that's Pidgeot. Did I say Pidgeot? I'm sorry if I did say that. Moving on, we have Onyx. If I can pull that out. And I believe, I'm pretty sure that the, was it the common Onyx has less HP? This is a 90 HP one. So yeah. That's pretty cool, and you get the nice little tropical tree, the palm tree on the side, telling you where, which uh, set it came from. Alright, and here we have the first uh, reverse hollow that I have. For And, yeah, I'm trying to pull that out with the sleeve. Uh, as you can see, very nice. Oh, that, that's really beautiful, guys. Like, you can see the camera almost perfectly. Um, again, just look at that. Wow, like you can't you can't say anything about bad about this thing. Looks like there's no really any scratches on this thing, and I believe this no this wasn't the first Togepi to be printed out like that. So yeah, moving on we have Ivysaur. Nice, nice, nice. Next we have Radicate. Again, very nice. Ladyba, another reverse hollow. I like this one, the nice little green reverse hollow. 
for grass. Pretty cool. Jigglypuff. Very simple. Butterfree. Tends to cruel. Uh, we have a Meryl. I like this Meryl a lot. That looks just way too cool, guys. Pretty nice. Then moving on, we have a Labrys. Really simple there. Executor or Executor, whatever your preference is. Uh, another one of my favorites. I, I really like Slowking. It's one of my best EV Pokemon. If you watch my uh, Wi-Fi battles, it's, it, it's an orange Pokemon. I, I really like this card. This is pretty cool. A Royal Pokemon. Very nice. War Turtle. It seems to me, guys, that um, the uh, only basic cards, like the Johto um, region cards, are the, the second, either the second or the third um, uh, stage card. The first or, yeah, stage, yeah, second stage evolution or third stage evolution. The, um, this was because Lickitung didn't have a evolution uh, until Diamond and Pearl and Platinum. So yeah, like Lapras still doesn't have an evolution here. I would like to see something with that, probably in 5th gen if they do come up with that. Um, and I think that's it um, for the single, that's the only one I believe that has a single. These two are the only uh, basic Pokemon cards, or stage first stage Pokemon cards. Uh, Vileplume. Very, very nice. Again, with the grass, I like that. And the last one of the um, of the set, Primeape. Very nice. Got a little Venomoth in the background. If I'm not mistaken, this was the um, first set to have another Pokemon in the background other than itself. Like I just showed you with the uh, with the Primeape, because you have a, a Venomoth and a Primeape in the same picture so yeah again these are great cards and if you do own one of those with the binder that came with it I believe it was a binder that came with it uh, retail price is twenty dollars what it's going for right now is twenty if you have it separately it's around fifteen without the binder um, right now it's worth about eleven to fourteen dollars because I don't have that Mew so again this is a great collector's item if you if you don't have this set, I truly, truly recommend you have this. Alright, so I, this is actually a longer video than I intended for. So, uh, comment, rate, subscribe, and uh, thanks a lot, guys.